Hello, this is Heath from Ezos. This is a video to introduce you the file backup option in a software to do backup. File backup is a dedicated option to protect important files on your PC, like business documents, family pictures, favorite videos, and others. The option transfers all selected files and folders into a PPD file. The process can be also considered as a kind of method to archive the vital files just in case any unexpected error happens on the way you use your PC. Now I'll show you how to use this option step by step. Click the build task and switch to file page, then filter and select all the files and folders that you want to include in current backup. Click on browse to select another path if you do not want to save the PPD image file to the default destination folder. Here I select the folder name target on desktop. It is possible to enable schedule to run the backup automatically on a regular basis. For more about the schedule backup option, you may have a search in our video library. We have a specific video for it too. After you finish all the settings, just click proceed to start running the backup. Backup finishes. It's really easy, huh? There are several common scene situations that users may be so desperate and need to recover the files back. Software and hardware failures, deleted files by mistake, incorrectly modify a file, etc. When any of these become a real problem, the backup image file then works like an insurance. It allows you to recover the files back to your PC from the image file just like nothing terrible has ever happened. To do a recovery, just select the backup task and click on the recovery button. Then you will be able to decide which files to recover and where to recover to. This is a standard recovery process and compared to that, we also offer an easier way to recover one or several specific files from the image file. On the PC where you have our backup software installed, the image file can be accessed just like a normal folder in Windows. You can double click on it and copy and paste the files you want out of the image file for use. Okay, this is how to use a file backup option in our backup software. If you still have any question about it, just feel free to contact our support team. Thank you very much for your watching.